What's up, Miwa Nation? Um, you know, let's jump right into it. Meat is a huge part of the paleo diet. Uh, and, and the reason we emphasize eating lean meat is because we want to avoid eating too much of the bad omega-6 fats, which are much more prevalent um, in industrial meat than in grass-fed meat. So a higher omega-6 diet actually increases inflammation, which is one of the main issues we're trying to solve with the paleo-type diet. Um, inflammation is part of a whole host of autoimmune deficiencies and therefore we want to keep our omega-6 fat intake as low as possible. When you're at the supermarket, buy lean meat because this meat is most likely corn-fed and industrially raised, not grass-fed. Um, and we want to avoid all the, the bad fats, the omega-6 fats, that are in this industrial meat when we eat. So, when you're buying grass-fed meat or pasture-raised pork, you need to worry less about how lean your meat is because grass-fed meat has two advantages um, because it comes from animals that are one, eating their natural diet, and two, that are a whole lot more physically active. Um, grass-fed meat accordingly has a much higher omega-3 fat content um, and, and those omega-3 fats are proven to be anti-inflammatory in nature. Um, the fat in conventional meat that omega-6 fat uh, causes inflammation and you should avoid. So keep that in, in mind when you're, when you're buying at the supermarket. Um, however, I recommend finding a good, reliable source that you can get grass-fed meat. Begin with your local farmer's market or, uh, or, or community co-op. Um, it's, it's really not actually too hard to find a supply. And if you're having trouble, just leave a comment below and we'll, we'll get back to you. Um, some supermarkets now even carry cuts of meat that are grass-fed. Just be sure to check the label on the packaging before you buy. Um, so with that being said, let's just review a few cuts of meat that are lean. Um, examples include poultry in general, sirloin, bottom round, eye round, top round, pork tenderloin, pork sirloin chops. These are okay to buy conventionally because they're lean. Obviously, we'd recommend you buy grass-fed. Um, and, and all those cuts in general have less than 50% fat content, calorically speaking. Again, the fattier cuts of meat, we want to encourage you to avoid unless they're, they're grass-fed or pasture-raised. And these fattier cuts include salami, bacon, ground beef, ground pork, hot dogs, pork sausages, pork ribs, ribeye steak, and T-bone steak. So all of, the, uh, all of those have greater than 65% fat, and, and that's a whole lot of unwanted inflammatory calories. Um, so again, the moral of the story here is eat grass-fed meat. Um, if you can't afford it, be sure that you're buying lean cuts in the supermarket. So anyways, thanks for tuning in. We'll see you next time.